Winter weather created some serious trouble on the roads. It led to a deadly pileup, shutting down Interstate 80 in both directions. Eyewitness News reporter Sean Coffey has been on the scene all morning and joins us live now with the very latest there. Sean. Kelly, good morning. Pennsylvania State Police say the pileup that shut down I-80 in both directions involved anywhere between 30 and 60 vehicles with two confirmed fatalities. As of now, the interstate's been shut down between Lock Haven and Loganton for over 18 hours now, and crews are still working to clear the area. A deadly pileup in Clinton County has left two dead and multiple people injured. Cars and trucks stuck in the snowy conditions with nowhere to go while tow trucks and state police work to clear the wreck they say involves dozens of vehicles. One driver we spoke with was traveling from New Jersey to Ohio when he reached the log jam, saying he's been waiting in his cab since 4 p.m. yesterday for the road to open. Things happen all the time, man. It, just, it was a regular stop, and then they tell us to just going to park over here for a little bit. And while this interstate has been shut down for over 12 hours now, and many of these vehicles have been here since yesterday late afternoon, one driver we spoke with said she was still able to get onto the interstate without being stopped. There was, there was no blockage. The ramp you could get on coming from Lock Haven, but I had to like swing out around and. No signs that said. No yeah. signs that said road closed that I saw. State police are working to keep any more cars from getting on the highway, even having some turn around and drive east on the westbound lanes to the nearest turnaround. Dominguez says he's never seen anything like it. Never happened before. First time ever. The first time, yeah. Usually it's two hours, three hours. Not for this long. I spoke with PSP Lamar a short while ago, and they said there's still no update as to the number of fatalities or when the road will reopen. But PennDOT just issued a press release a short while ago saying they don't expect it to reopen until the afternoon now. For now, both directions of I-80 remain shut down between exits 185 and 178. Again, that's between Lock Haven and Loganton exits as uh, to give those crews that are working the scenes and trying to clear the scenes more access to the pileup itself. For now in Clinton County, Sean Coffey, Eyewitness News. Quite a tragedy there, Sean. Thank you.